Today we're looking at brazing or silver soldering. Um, now, uh, essentially all this is, is it's a higher temperature version of your normal soldering. Now, you may wonder why that's so cool. Um, the reason is, is that you can, you can do so much more. Um, a perfect example, if you're soldering a piece of copper pipe to another piece of copper pipe, um, the bits of copper have almost got to touch the fitting. Um, if not, the solder won't bridge the gap. Very different with this stuff. Here's an example. What I've done here, just to show you, I've stuffed one piece of copper pipe baggily into another and I've started brazing it. You can see here how what it's done is it's brazed lovely around here and I've still got a hole here. In a minute, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get going again, I'm going to heat it up and I'm going to complete the job without needing to clean it, without needing to and without this solder falling out. And then if I wanted to, I could actually then go and literally take another piece of copper pipe and solder it on half an inch away. Sorry, braise it on half an inch away, there even. That's really useful if you're doing something like this. Yeah, I'm going to get the word steampunk left, right and centre now. Doing something like this is a cap for a chimney. Um, the problem I was having here was that I could solder this on here, so I could just solder this piece of brass to these two plates here. Um, but what I couldn't do was solder any more bits on, because what was happening then is it was all just dropping off, because the heat was transferring down, and the, 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 the temperature that the... Um, solder melts at is so low it just drops out so this is really useful stuff uh, you can stick bits of brass together with it um, all kinds of things really and as I say this is um, this is actually a refrigerant engineers type of, uh, of rod um, there's many other types silver solder all can be got from eBay um, the good thing is you use your normal gas not oxyacetylene uh, this is a propane um, it works better with the map gas which is the yellow bottle but this will do it fine and I'll just fill in this well for you now so you can see. Um, it's going to be a bit noisy, but hopefully you can see how it goes. see how the surface tension holds that beautifully um, there's no damage to the back none of that around the back has collapsed at all um, what it's done is it's literally we've managed to solder one side or braze one side while the other side is uh, remains intact this is extremely useful you can braze together um, bits of brass uh, brass to copper you can't do ferrous metals you have to do non-ferrous um, but it's an extremely useful uh, and versatile piece of uh, piece of equipment to use. Now, um, I've used this for the other thing is you don't have to clean it, so because um, it actually it'll burn the, the muck out itself mostly. So I've used it for um, copper airlines on um, yeah on, on airline equipment uh, and bits and bobs like that. Um, there is it's an extremely strong, but it is quite a brittle um, bond. Um, so yeah, there we are. I uh, hope that helps. Cheers for now.